Dale Green and Lamar Gordon, both 17, were given life terms for murder, shaking hands, celebrating the killing of the schoolboy. Nicholas Pearton was 16 when he was murdered, stabbed through the heart after trying to run away. He'll be shouting and calling me Peter Boyle. I'm going to kill him. I knew what, what happened would happen. I'm not saying it's right, I'm not saying what they did was right, but I can see why they flipped. How old are you? I'm a little boy! Oh. Up to you! Look, I've had my house. <laughs> I don't know how you pronounce his name. Please turn over to me. Despite calling to the police, despite calling to the council repeatedly, repeatedly, he received no support. He was ignored. Papa, be quiet. Do you not understand? Shut up! Four people have been charged with hate crimes for the brutal beating of a mentally disabled man. Smack his ass again! Uh, smack smack him, him again! The teen was tied up for about five hours, during which time the suspects allegedly beat him, made him drink toilet water, cut his hair and scalp, while blasting him with racial slurs. More than a dozen boys seen in this video stomping and kicking the girl on a street corner in Crown Heights yesterday afternoon. One boy even seen stealing her shoes. They also took her cell phone and a debit card. A witness tells us the attack left the girl unconscious. She's now in the hospital with head and face injuries. As a homeowner is attacked by a mob in her own driveway. She gets punched, kicked, and stomped on. Her husband tries to save her, and the punks turn on him. Look at the assailants. There are young women among them. I have two black eyes. I have bruising on my ears. I have bruising all along my forehead, my nose, my other ear. I have all this. This is all bruised. They were dancing around the NBC TV director before the six suspects attacked 72-year-old John Sullivan on his way to work.